to bumper, we love them old cars. All right, Ken, g'day and welcome to Bumper to Bumper. How are you going? Good, thank you very much for interviewing me. Okay, Ken, now you've got a HT 1969 Monaro. It looks immaculate. Yeah, well, we put a bit of work into it. You don't look too bad. All right, how long have you had this car for, mate? Uh, about 10 years. Oh, okay. And what, what was the condition of the car when you first got it? Uh, pretty average. She had a bit of rust and a bit of this and that on it, but we cleaned her up. And me and my son-in-law does all the work on it. Yeah. And what were some of the major things that you had to do on it? Uh, just all the bling-bling stuff. The motors and gearboxes and uh, Paul Rogers put the transmission and that in the for me. Yep. Now, today we're here at Spring, Spring Nats in Shepparton. You've got the car out here. You're doing the go-to-woe. What else are you doing? Uh, we're going to do all the events except that burnout stuff. We're not doing that. Right. Why is that? Uh, just a bit too much rubber to clean. Yeah, yeah, it puts a lot of rubber on the car, doesn't it? Uh, it certainly does, yeah. So ha how's it gone this morning? Oh, very nice, very nice. We had to put a couple of batteries in it, but uh, we got over the top of it. Now, why we had to put batteries in? Uh, probably a bit old. You or the car? Oh, both. <laughs> <laughs> now, what's the times you've been running for the go to woe then? Are you competitive? Uh, yeah, five, nine. Uh, that's the quickest. Mm. Now you know the interesting thing that I find about uh, Spring Nats is that you're actually not only um, going in the competition but you've got your car here on display in the e exhibition building too. Yeah well we do that every year, I think we've got uh, Grand Champion three years in a row. Right so this is a car that you, you, you obviously you cherish but also you like to get out and drive it. Oh we like to drive it, we like to show it and let the crowd all see it and it's for everyone. Yeah well it's a beautiful stunning looking car mate, a lot of work gone into this. Yeah, well, uh, congratulations to all my pit crew and all the people yeah. that helps me. All right, now your pit crew's here today. Name yep. some of those people. Oh, there's uh, Jenna, my granddaughter. Yep. Jesse, my grandson. And uh, uh, Jason. Uh, he's uh, Nathan. No. I get mixed up, but. Yeah, yeah you. <laughs> Nathan. You, you know him well, don't you? <laughs> no, not very well. <laughs> They just like to come with the car. Yeah. So it's great that you got your family involved in the whole thing, though, because it obviously it, it, it brings a little uh, a close bond. Oh, look, I'd never do it. I'm 72, and uh, I'd never do it without my grandchildren. No, they're, they're fantastic. Just, they're fantastic to have your family. Yeah. Well, I want to wish you well for uh, the weekend. I hope you do well at Spring Nets, because you're actually driving yourself, which is fantastic itself. You're, you're young at heart, mate. I'm um, uh, 27 years old today. Yeah, you did. I was going to say 26. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I just reversed the numbers. <laughs> yeah, well done. All right, Ken, well, I wish you all the very best, and thanks for being on Bubba to Bubba. Thank you very much. Okay, cheers.